Christchurch has come alive with some of the most incredible art as the city evolves. And they've brought in street artists from right across the world to paint up some of the buildings. But it all starts here. This is the epicentre of art. This is the beautiful art gallery. And do you see on top of the art gallery, there is a giant hand. And that giant hand is by an artist called Rooney Van Hoot. And the interesting thing about Rooney is he likes to model all his artworks on his own body parts. Everywhere you go in Christchurch, there are new buildings popping up, sometimes right next to a bit of heritage architecture. And with these new buildings come some pretty bland walls, the perfect canvas for some seriously talented artists. Here's a few pieces of art you have to check out that are giving this city a very contemporary contrast. Number one for me is Hide and Seek by Kiwi artist Wongi. His work is playing a major role in transforming graffiti art in Christchurch. He specialises in large-scale murals and photorealism. Number two on my list of street art here is Lips by Tilt, a French artist who loves to use big, bold 3D lettering to create hidden messages, whilst using bright colours to create a striking art piece at the same time. And number three, well, you can't keep a good Aussie away. This is Brick Girl by one of Melbourne's most prolific street artists, Roan. Best known for his haunting and yet stylized images of women's faces, 